here next problem is anova analysis of variance is very very important problem here yeah here whatever the problem the steps first i will tell the steps here you will get this kind of the data here here in the one way anova you have only a b c d like that only columns only one objective will be there here in this object you have to do that one this one is the anova problem here some kind of the problem first you have to read that one what they are asking and how you have to solve the problem here the some steps are there here in the anova first you have to take here in this steps a b c d four values are there na here this first column you take as a x1 b is x2 c is x3 d is x4 here into the x1 sample 1 here into the large items are there that's why here they are detected the 20 from the each unit each objective they are detected the 20 that's why 20 minus 20 it is into the zero values like that they are taken 0 minus 1 1 here the x1 values are there this x1 values you have to go for the next x1 square the similarly the three samples also you have to take the next step is there total total the sum of the total you have to calculate here 0 plus 9 plus 6 plus 3 is it whatever the total value is there 18 is the total value next we will find out the correction factor that correction factor is there total sum of square total square divided by grand total square divided by n n is the number of items into the entire problem here into the 4 3 are 12 is there na the 12 will be coming here t square by n that is into the here that answer it came to the 27 next you have to calculate the sst that is the total sum of the squares total sum of the squares here here the square values into the x1 you are calculated next you are calculated x1 square na that x1 square x2 square x3 square x4 square the totals the four totals you will take and minus this correction factor value will do that one you will get this kind of the value next you have to do the sstr sum of squares between the samples here the squares between the samples will be there that here whatever the x1 whole square x2 whole square x3 whole square x4 whole square that values divided by whatever the values how many items are there here 1 2 that is the n1 n2 n3 n4 like that you have to calculate here you will get the answer of here the 16 the 15 answer you got that one the next you have to calculate the ssc ssc answer will coming into the this sst value minus sstr value 39 minus 15 equal to 24 will be value it will be coming next uh, here we have to go through the degrees of freedom will be there rows minus 1 uh, that is into the how many rows are there here rows in the means of 1 2 3 4 row low here into the row how many values are there four values are there the simply people are going for rows in the means of 1 2 3 like that they will they will go not like that in the row how many values are there that value we will take as a row 4 minus 1 equal to 3 will come okay next here into the one way anova we'll go for the df2 value is there that is into the n minus r total number total how many things are there 12 is there na 12 minus r in the row how many values are there that is into the 4 equal to that is into that it came to the 8 next you have to calculate the means square values here into the this table we have to maintain on that one here the sum of variations sum of squares degrees of freedom means square and f statistics will be there whatever the te test statistics f we, we are doing about on that one in the between the samples here this value we have to put here the sstr value sstr value will come next 24 value is there ssc value we will write then ssc value then here it is coming into the sst value here this one is the r minus 1 this one is the n minus r here the means square is there 
எம் எஸ் டிஆர் ஈக்குவல் டு எஸ்எஸ்டிஆர் பை டிகிரிஸ் ஆஃப் ஃப்ரீடம் ஒன் டிகிரிஸ் ஆஃப் ஃப்ரீடம் ஒன் இஸ் தேர் த்ரீ டூ த்ரீ டிஎஃப் ஒன் இஸ் த்ரீ வேல்யூ டிஎஃப் டூ இஸ் எயிட் வேல்யூ அண்ட் ஹியர் மீன்ஸ் ஸ்கொயர் இஸ் தேர் எம்எஸ்டிஆர் ஈக்குவல் டு எஸ்எஸ்டிஆர் பை டிஎஃப் ஒன்னு எம்எஸ்சி ஈக்குவல் டு எஸ்எஸ்சி ஈக்குவல் டு டிஎஃப் டூ ட்வெண்ட்டி ஃபோர் பை எயிட் தட் இஸ் இன் டு த த்ரீ வேல்யூ யூ காட் திஸ் வேல்யூஸ் ஃபைனல்லி யூ ஹேவ் டு கேலிக்குலேட் த எம்எஸ்டிஆர் பை எம்எஸ்சி எம்எஸ்டிஆர் பை எம்எஸ்சி தென் யூ வில் கெட் திஸ் இஸ் த கேலிக்குலேட்டட் வேல்யூ then how you will see this one the table value degrees of freedom 1 is 3 degrees of freedom 2 is 8 at the level of here into the problem they didn't mention the significance value we will consider as a 0.05 how we will see into the table value i will show wait this is the table value here in this table value here we will see the degrees of freedom value 1 is into the vertically we will see sorry horizontally we will see the degrees of freedom 1 value degrees of freedom 2 value into the vertically here degrees of freedom 1 is 3 na 3 at degrees of freedom 2 8 8 plus this is the value of your answer is 4.0662 okay clear degrees of freedom 1 degrees of freedom 2 clear mama here into the two we are also same the table only it will be coming here you see this one the table value is 4.07 since your calculated value is degrees of freedom is 1.1.67 then it is into the less than the table value the null hypothesis is accepted hence we reject yeah here we conclude that difference in the mean lifetime of the four brands of the bulbs is to be not significant we infer the average lifetime of the four brands of the bulbs is equal here like that we have to write table value our calculated value is less than the table value that's why your problem is accepted your hypothesis is accepted okay mama do properly i hope everyone understood thank you